Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So I'm pretty sure you're familiar with downloading TV shows and if you do it, then you might have a hard time renaming the files or some of you might don't even bother doing it because uh, you know why. But people who like to make collections, they like doing it. So I'm right now downloading lots of content for my TV channels I'm making. And as you can see, if I run tree command here, so look at the file names, it's a mess, okay? And you just want all the, all the TV shows in your collection to be you know something better than this okay so what you can do is especially actually there are programs out there there's one program filebot but that's a proprietary software and there are some other uh, programs but they're pretty complicated and also they're GUI so if you're a CLI lover you might have hard time so first of all let me just rename these seasons okay so if you look at the flex guide how to organize your file collection then it should be like this so for example let's just organize this so uh, let me just type the name all right and it uh, there are there is supposed to be years but let's not do this uh let's make w capital m capital and we just renamed our root directory of a tv show now i like to use vimb to just uh, sometimes just to quickly rename uh like seasons so okay this says I'm having a hard time using Vim because I am using too much Emacs. Just kidding, not really. So with Vimb, I already showed you Vimb. You can just quickly rename files with within Vim. I mean, it just it's it works really awesome. Like it's a simple script. So now the most hardest part, like look at this. How we are going to do this? So there is this program which you can install with. Um, wait a second. Uh, okay so you can just type this and uh this program will get installed so its name is hard to pronounce minamur okay and what you can do is uh you can just give the season one and just press enter and as you can see it's asking for the new name so as you can see the old name have no episode name but here we have like episode name but i don't want to do this there are plenty like I, i'm not going to do it individually like one by one so i can look at to help and uh, as you can see there are a lot of options so there is one option for batch and one uh, option for recursive okay so what i can do is i can just type myanmar b r and then the entire root directory and press enter. So this is recursively going to find all the files. And as you can see, it just renamed everything correctly. And le let me go inside this directory and type tree dot and whoa, look at this beauty. It's it. If I open like Wikipedia, um, Wikipedia dot com. Uh, all right. It's org. Sorry. Okay. Let's just, uh, see the episode list episode list okay i should have used google i know all right so i just want to verify whether the episode names are correct or not so let's just pick any random okay so if i look into season two episode four so let's just look into season two episode four so it's pluto something like okay i should i should install that patch which okay let me just i don't like having that patch which fix uh on fly okay girls meet pluto girls meet pluto okay uh, as you can see it's correct okay season two episode one season four and it's it's correct okay so the good thing about using this tool is all my tv show have same formatting of the name and it makes life a lot simpler otherwise you won't believe previously i was doing it manually like i was literally using Wimby to rename i was not typing the name of the show but i just love this tool like it just made my life so simple and it just works great also it's cli so it's good for my because these days i'm trying to stick more and more with cli programs okay so yeah thanks for watching that's the video